In 1602, the Dutch East India Company came to India and established trading centers at Surat, Broch, Kambe, Cochin, Nagapatnam, Mosuli Patnam, and Chinsur. In the politics of Kerala, the one who lived in the most important phase and rescued an important principality from the foreigners was Raja Marthanda Verma of Vainad. He ruled from 1729 to 1758 and saved from the surrounding rulers as well as foreigners. He made this as a great kingdom among Gaul. He stood against foreigners who were greedy of pepper and brought many reforms in administration. He shifted his capital from Padmanabhapura to Tiruvananthapura and made his kingdom as World Travancore Province. There were confusions and chaos in the kingdom before Marthanda Verma came to the throne. The earlier ruler Rama Verma was very weak. The Dutch East India Company possessed strong military power and had greater ambition in the politics. The surrounding rulers were also strong. Even at a tender age of 10, Marthanda Verma suggested strategies to his maternal uncle Rama Verma. for the rise of his province after rama verma at the age of 24 years marthanda verma came to the throne he compiled an army of 50000 soldiers to extend the border of vainad he occupied the pepper growing areas by this time the dutch who were trying to monopolize the trade was defeated by marthanda verma he controlled the surrounding areas and made them to oppose the dutch The Dutch, with the help of provinces like Kayamukulam, Kochi, Urakkad, and Vadukunkar, attacked on Travancore. Raja Marthanda defeated them and captured Nedumangala and Kottarakara province. He also wrote a strong letter to the Dutch that he would never give up the trade rights of pepper to any foreigners. In 1741, the Dutch declared war on Travancore. It got a Kerala province in the forefront. Some of the local provinces also joined the Dutch, but Marthanda Verma strongly sent it back. The Dutch came back to Cochin, but with the help of Simmalasi forces, the Dutch attacked Marthanda Verma. Four days serious battle took place from 10th August 1741 at Kolachal. Finally, Travancore army had an upper hand in the battle. and 24 important officers of the dutch were taken as prisoners the dutch suffered huge losses after the battle he did not keep quiet he decided to root out the dutch from india and establish the trade rights of pepper in kerala and tamil nadu he also got back the ports which were under the control of the dutch cochin was recognized as the center of spice trade during the period of marthanda verma The Travancore province became the richest province. Finally, on 15th August 1753, a treaty was signed and the Dutch forces surrendered its power to the Travancore province. This is how the period of Marthanda Verma has been recognized as an important phase in the history of India.